Hello everyone, welcome to Apollo tutorial video. Now this is another video. In this video I will show you how to get leads from Apollo IO and how to export them to a CSV file. Now there are a couple of ways how you can generate leads with Apollo IO. Obviously the first way is to go to the search and here as you can see you can go to the filters and there are a ton of different filters we can uh, you know, filter people by lists, by persona, by name, by job titles, by company, how much they're earning and stuff like that. So as you can see, for example, job titles. As you can see, we can see we want project manager. Uh, it's inclu included past job titles. We want to be a maybe manager, like maybe that, right? We can apply the filter. Obviously, based on that, we'll find our leads. We already have here uh, a couple of leads, like for example, these ones, right? So, okay, we can find leads this way. The, another way to find leads is to basically go and install Apollo IO Chrome extension. Now with Chrome extension, as you can see, this will uh, enable your uh, search to be on LinkedIn, Gmail and Google Calendar and all the other websites. So if you go to another website, we can find emails if we go to LinkedIn as well, for example, I visited this person here and as you can see here on the right side, I have actually a uh, contact where that I can save. Once I save the contact, I can also view email address here. Once I save the contact, I can go here uh, and I can go to my saved list or saved contacts and here I can uh, select the contacts. Now how you will select the contacts to export them is just select here. Once you select them, you can go here and export this to CSV, as you can see. Now you can export all emails or export verified emails only. You can hit save and this will export your uh, leads to CSV. So this is basically how you can find leads and get leads from Apollo IO, as well as export them as a CSV file. It's a very simple process. However, if you need any questions or anything, comment down below and we'll see you in the next video.